welcome back. This morning I set you the family planning puzzle. Did you solve it? The puzzle goes like this. A fictional government wants to increase the proportion of girls to boys in the population. It introduces a law, and the law says that if a couple has a boy, it has to have another child. But if a couple has a girl, it has no more children. In other words, couples must keep on reproducing until they produce girls, at which point they stop. The question is, ultimately, what is the proportion of girls to boys in the population? So, how do you solve it? First thing to realise, it's not a complicated problem. Don't overcomplicate it with equations or anything like that. The second thing is, we need to assume that you have a 50-50% chance of having a boy or a girl. So, what happens? We're going to put the couples here, and here we're going to have a tally of boys and girls. Every couple has a child. This is the first generation, and 50% are boys and 50% are girls. We can mark that in. Then the law comes into play. If you have a girl, then you have no more children. But if you have a boy, you have to have another child. And of those children in the second generation, 50% are going to be boys, 50% are going to be girls. So we can put the tally in here. Again, the law comes into force. The couples that had a boy and then a girl have no more children. The couples that had a boy and then a the boy have another child. And again, we know that the percentage of having a boy or a girl is 50-50. So, 50-50. And already you can see that a pattern is emerging. At every generation, the proportion of boys to girls is 50-50. So if each generation is 50-50, the combined total is also 50-50. And here we get the answer to the second question. There is no humane family planning policy that can alter the proportion of boys and girls in a population from 50-50. It is always 50-50. The reason why I like this puzzle is that you kind of think there would be some kind of strategy that would alter it, but there isn't. The proportion of boys to girls is always 50-50. As for the sex of my child, I can tell you with 100% certainty that it's a boy or a girl. Come back in two weeks for a completely different type of puzzle.